I'm Oliver Trevina, here with the girls themselves, Courtney and Chloe. How are you? Hello, Governor. That's their uh, English accent. Hello, mate. That's terrible. Yeah. Um, on to what you're good at, your show, second season. How was that? Well, this season is a lot more, I think, serious than the first season. I think the first season, Courtney and I were single sisters in Miami, really there to kind of just hang out and be single at the same time and enjoy each other more. And then I got married and Courtney got pregnant. She's going to Miami with Scott, her boyfriend, and her baby, and I go, she makes me go by myself. So I'm more of a visitor in her okay. home, and it was there was a lot of tension. Chloe, whenever Lamar was home, Chloe would go back and forth, and um, we went to fix our store dash um, that was in shambles because we hadn't gone back, and a lot of the girls that we hired were kind of there for the wrong reasons. The girls that we, you know, hired for the first season, we really were thrown into it doing it fast. And I think they thought, oh, if we work for them, we'll be on their show. I don't think they ever thought, we're leaving and the cameras come with us. Yeah. So they, their motives were wrong. So we got there, we fired everyone, we rehired people, and now the store is doing amazing. We fixed it. but. It was a struggle the first couple weeks. Chloe was just not into the store when we first got there. I think she was, you know, just not really into I didn't it. even want to be in Miami. I wanted to be with Lamar. I'm a newlywed. That's just what I want to do. My mind frame was not going to Miami and staying there for two and a half months in fixing the class, store. Yeah. Right? That's really not where right. my head was at. But Courtney guilt tripped me for days. I have a child. I need this store. I can't do this by myself. She's playing that card now, I'm isn't like, she? I'm like, oh yes. my god. So. It started off really bad, <laughs> Scott and I fighting all the time, but it ended, I think, on a positive note. We're in the middle. She doesn't not really. Well, not uh, for you, Courtney positive. Doesn't sold on the positive note. <laughs> you know, we kind of worked through everything, but in Miami, definitely went to a dark place. But there was some fun times. Chloe and I Courtney definitely and I had some fun times. We were alone, but that's after. We've Us men get in the way and it all right. messes up, doesn't it? Right. You know? Terrible. And then actually Kim is a lot more involved in season two than she was in season one. This time when Chloe ditched me and came home, Kim came and helped me with the store. Wait, I have to cut you off because you always say so far in the last two days, Chloe ditched me. Actually, if you want to rewind the tapes, you kicked me out. You said, fine, leave. And I said, fine, I will That doesn't leave. mean kicking you out. Um, yes, you actually pushed me out of the house because you were choosing Scott over me, therefore, I left. That's uh, all I needed. You leaving didn't have to do with Scott. Court. This is great, girls. Get everyone's out. <laughs> yeah. Carry on. Because she keeps saying I ditched her. I know, I've like, heard her say that a lot. Right? Yeah. A lot of times. Yeah. And I'm like, ditched you? Yeah. I felt sorry for you. I wondered when I you were going to bring that up. I was, hello. <laughs> yeah. Let's hear some more of your funny stories. What else? Chloe and I went scuba diving. We like, it Never was spring do that. break. Ever. And she conned me into going in the water, tried pushing me in the water. Like, What's going on here? The guilt trip in the con in the ditching. She's the, just a little yeah. infused. I was trying to make her have bad fun. No. And now the baby as well, pulling that card out the bag. He's so cute. Yeah. You feel bad saying no to these two faces. If I was little, maybe that would happen. But when you're bigger, no one feels sorry for you. I feel sorry for you. Oh, um, so we've got you. lots of conflict in the season. Can we expect a season three then? It doesn't sound like it. No. No? Okay, Get great. No. Back to Miami. <laughs> no cliffhanger there, is there? No, no cliffhanger. <laughs> Unless we got... Can we all jump in together? Yeah, what if Lamar came along? I mean, that would have to be during his off season and I'm not sure that would go well. <laughs> she said, okay. I'm sad you couldn't work that out. That was her humor. Oh. That was funny. That was good. See, I was on your side. Now I've changed sides now. Yeah. Yeah, maybe you should switch seats. Yeah. Um, for me now, I'm kind of scared to ask any more questions. <laughs> okay, good. So, uh, thanks for coming in. Yay, and, uh, you're good the luck new with Dr. Everything Drew. You do. I, I'm like Dr. Drew. Dr. Drew. Dr. Drew. <laughs> Dr. Drew. Dr. Drew. I don't know if I like that. He's that old guy, isn't he? Yeah. Thanks for that. You're welcome. Thanks for that. We'll definitely wrap this up now. Good. <laughs> yeah. Good luck with everything. Thanks, girls. Thank, Thank you. you. Yay. Great. That's it. That was fun.